victory at a track meet turned into a life-changing event for a local teen when he realized he hadn't really earned the Blue Ribbon. I've never had this happen ever in I've coached for many, many, many years. I've never, ever had this happen. This is something you've never seen before, probably won't see again, and it's a story you don't want to miss. It's a story you may never have heard before. After winning first place at a track event, a local teen realized he wasn't the true winner. Instead of just being quiet, he made sure the blue ribbon went to the right person. Reporter Melissa Dudon has the story. Winning first place in the long jump earlier this month was a good feeling for 14-year-old Faith Lutheran 8th grader Austin Daigle. But his celebration was short-lived. During the jump, his dad snapped these pictures of his son. What these shots captured changed everything. I, I kind of saw it right away that I scratched, like just right off the back, saw it. Daigle says after learning he hadn't truly won, he needed to get this blue ribbon to its rightful owner. He and his dad made the trek to Pahrump to hand over the ribbon to 14-year-old Glenn Ivy of Rosemary Clark Middle School, who had jumped his personal best. That's nice and he's a good person to do that. Just kind. Normally they would just keep it and wouldn't have even care. Would have just said they won, but he was nice enough to come and bring it back. Thanks to the honesty of Daigle, Ivy now has his first ever long jump blue ribbon. Daigle now holds the second place red ribbon, a prize he says he'll cherish. The second place ribbon I think I'm more proud of than any of the first place ribbons just because I, I did my best in the jumps and finally did scratch. It's good to know that I did the right thing and that I think I'll be proud of that ribbon for the rest of my life. Melissa Dudon, 8 News Now. See, I told you you didn't want to miss that story. Mm -hmm. Austin Daigle's father says it was his son's idea to deliver the ribbon to his competitor. He says they couldn't be prouder of their son's choice. Mm -hmm.